you can see this is a compact NC8000 HP and what we're going to try to do today is put Mac OS Jazz 10 5.4 you can download this at Pirate Bay or Google and try to find it and just burn it on the CD so what you do first is you obviously put the CD in and you should have your BIOS set up where it boots the CD obviously not the hard drive so you just wait for it to load the CD real quick you can see there's an antique right here so it lags alright here we go here we go now press any key to start from the CD and just let it do its thing so right now it's just gonna load up the CD this process takes a very very long time so I suggest while it loads up and everything you go do something unless you have patience because I don't so yeah it's gonna take a long ass time so go play Call of Duty or whatever the fuck you do just do it alright so finally the CD finally loaded to this menu I forgot to mention earlier you might have to change the BIOS to from RAID to the other option so here we go let's get ready right here you just obviously whatever language you speak that is obviously the language you're gonna have to put here we go so it's a little load okay now when you get to this option you click on continue and whatever it says blah 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 it's just disagree so when you get right here you go to ut utilities up here Okay, and then you go to this utility. Alright, now that it has loaded the disk drive, you, you click on the hard drive and you click on erase. So make sure you don't have anything. Make sure you don't have any, anything that you want in the hard drive, obviously. So you click on macOS Extended Journal on the volume format before you click on erase. And you can name it whatever you like. I'm just gonna leave it as default, whatever. And click erase. Now just let it do its thing. So now you go to partition. And you click on however many you want. When you exit it,
and click on customize so now right here so you click on stuff and pretty much drivers etc and for the NC8000 you will have to click on stage okay And on this, I will click on Intel. As you can see, let me just click done and install. So I do is. Take out the CD, reboot it, and just click enter. And obviously, on title one and the blue options, click minus F and enter. And this process also takes like 10 minutes. So what you do now is you have to connect a keyboard, a USB obviously, and a USB mouse obviously to the back of the computer in order for it to work because the keyboard mouse from the or touchpad from the actual computer will not work until you install the drivers for it, which I will do in a bit right now. There we go, let's see what happens. Mac. Uh, so now we got Mac officially installed. As you can see, everything works. Let's install the drivers for the video card. There you go. So the same same process as before. So we got a lot more files. You copy you highlight all of them. So got all these motherfuckers here. And then you press PL and then you click on install the same way. Let's see. Let's see if it looks so bad for me. 